you guys have an, an, sort of an ingenious setup. You live in the house on the, sh the show. Your characters live in a house. You actually decided to live in that house to save money? Is that right? <laughs> yeah. We were convinced we were going to get canceled. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Once we came up with it uh, as tight butthole as our slogan, we were like, this is going one season, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, we actually lived in that house before, and when we were scouting, we were like, we're going to get canceled. We have to, we have to save money. And so we uh, continued living there. It's, just, it's a pigsty, though. It's disgusting. I think we have a picture. This is, yeah. I believe a picture from. <laughs> oh, that's. That's from the show. That's, oh, that's actually. Before. Oh, that's yeah. before. Yeah. <laughs> that's before you cleaned it up. Yeah, that's, right. we cleaned it up for the show. Um, okay, now, when you lived in that house, you don't live there anymore, is that right? No, no, no. we've moved. Yeah. Okay, okay moved but on. when you did live there, fans of the show could find out where that house was, go to it, knock on the door and you'd be living there. Yeah. yeah, it would blow some minds. It was just, uh, what's up, man? It was cool, it was a lot of uh, free drugs. I'm not, you know, I keep outing myself, <laughs> but a lot of people just like, do you want to smoke? And a lot of like, ah, you know, I shouldn't, it's, uh, yeah, okay. okay. You know what, I wasn't wearing a watch either. It's so yeah, strange you know? for the characters to, the, the people playing the characters to actually live in the home. Who lives there now if you moved out? Is it, is it now owned by responsible human beings? Oh, no, 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 no. No, it's kind of turned into this weird, like, flop house where anybody can, well, within the family or friends can right, don't live trouble. there. Yeah, my, yeah. my younger brother lives there. Uh, my best buddy lives there from uh, high school. <clears throat> but there's these, you don't want to live there or even visit, I wouldn't recommend, no. because there's just giant human rats yeah. that live there. Yeah. yeah. We, we found, like, a three-pound... You just said giant human rats. They're the well, size of, like, a newborn. Oh, they're the size they're of a well, well, and when okay. you live amongst the rats long enough, it's almost like you become a rat. We, we went through it. Yeah. We really did. I never lived there, thank God. Yeah. You were... He has a girl that loves him. Yeah. So he didn't have to go down that path. <laughs> so you, you, you lived with rats. <laughs> How bad was it? Uh, there was one, like, 24-hour period that we killed something like 18 rats. Yeah. <laughs> we call it the night of many kills. Of many kills. Yeah. Blake found me just shirtless with a bottle of Windex and a broom. Yeah. And I killed four rats that way. Just... <laughs> Come at me, Peter. Yeah. <laughs> I'm right here, and I'll do it again. <laughs> just save the just rats. Just don't wear a, a coat made of rats. Yeah, they won't get mad at you. Yeah. Well, were I mean, you drinking the Windex? What yeah, what Windex you, do? Yeah. Uh, you, I mean, you, you spray them in the eyes, and then they go blind, and then you hit them with a... I don't want to... <laughs> this is common sense. I mean, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's a, it acts as Who like... Who figured this out? <laughs> How did you find that out? You can see anything on YouTube. It's like, it's like you can figure anything from out. Eloise. Yeah. <laughs> like some, you know, home tip on HDTV. Here's a tip. Spray the rats in the eyes with Windex. <laughs> yeah. They'll go blind. Hit them with a the broom. Like, it sounds like Martha Stewart got to yeah. this one eventually. Yeah. Yeah. You know, like, here's what you do. I know how to yeah, solve yeah. this problem. <laughs> Squeeze them in the eye and then bang? Yeah. It was weird that it, it got so normal that they'd come out and see me doing this. And they're like, what's up, Adam? Just getting some milk. And I'm like, yeah, OK. <laughs> You just hold a bag of rats. Yeah, a plastic bag, kind of swing it and yeah. bam. <laughs> Everyone hates me now. Yeah. But if you were living amongst them, you would know what I was going. You for. could hear yeah. them in the walls. It was yeah. bad. That's nicer than the, like the sticky traps where they're just like face gets stuck to it and then they can't breathe and they're crying for their friends. <laughs> Help me! me! No, I disagree. I think you ask any rat, he'll take the sticky trap. No, 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 no. Over hey pal, the wind, squat, the and then bang. And the broom. No, the you don't. The windex and broom you don't is speak, the bullet to the head. You don't yeah. speak for rats. If you open one so of you're like, traps, trust me, I know what the rats want. <laughs> open the traps of those things and they have like the day count scratch yeah. on the inside. They're like, day nine, must stay sane. Still here. Help will come. Yes. Yeah. yeah, that's the nice thing is they, the sticky traps always come with a little journal. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> the rat, in day yeah. 14, still no Windex. Put me out of my misery.